In an update on La Souffre now, this morning, lead scientist on the monitoring team, Professor Richard Robinson, said there appears to be a minor waning of its force. He said, however, this does not mean at this time that the volcano is any less dangerous. It's still shaking a lot. That's why we have the earthquakes. But then these breaks, after these breaks, you tend to have an explosive event. The explosions, these explosions so far have not been as vigorous as when the eruption started. Um, they still create eruption plumes. They still have tremendous potential to produce paraclass cycles on the volcano itself. And because of the eruption plumes, they, tend to, they, they have the potential to, to put a lot of ash into areas which are occupied. Fortunately, the last set of them has, have actually gone towards the west, so that both Barbados and St. Vincent Grenadines have not really had that much ash, if any. Uh, Prof. Robinson told the farmers that with help from the authorities, they can venture into the red zone to feed their animals. He was less than complimentary to someone who took video while standing on the ledge of the volcano. Well, people talk about bravery, and to me, somebody is brave when you when you are aware of the, the risk that you put yourself to, and because of some some um, because of your job or because of the need to contribute to society in a fundamental way you still take the action or you need to save your family or something like that. So you are aware of the risk. You know you could be killed or you know you could be hurt, but you still do it. That's a brave person. A brave person is not somebody who goes up to the mountain, who don't understand the risk, um, putting themselves and their parties at risk, and the people who might have to rescue them. That person is not brave. To me, that person is just simply dotish. The scientist made it clear that people need to be brave to save their families at this time and not to risk life and limb in a show of bravado, which is counterproductive to the person, his associates, and those who might be inspired to try the same type of action.